So today, or maybe a few days ago, you signed into your computer or booted it up and found that your desktop was missing. And all you were left with was this, a bunch of tiles just floating here in the middle of the screen. You try to click the start button, nothing happens. Can't see any of the files on your desktop. And you're just about to lose it. If you don't know what's going on here, this can actually be a super annoying problem, but it's very f simple to fix. What's going on here is this computer is in tablet mode. This is a feature of Windows 10 um, designed for devices like the Surface Pro or other Windows tablets where the primary input device is a touchscreen. Uh, and typically these are machines with smaller screens and you've got we've got big fat fingers and so it's hard to navigate so this is tablet mode and it's very easy to fix um, what you need to do is take your mouse cursor down here to the notifications area click on this guy here and you'll see right here this first button tablet mode click that and boom desktops back you can see your icons the start button does stuff again and everything is right with the world now you may also be experiencing a problem with um, the full screen start menu which is a feature that can get turned on sometimes and it's kinda similar um, you'll still see your desktop uh, but when you click the start button you'll be you'll see all of your live tiles all these essentially these things right here floating in the middle of the screen and that's pretty easy to turn off too now I'm making this video in a virtual machine and I have not yet activated Windows on it so um, we're not gonna be able to actually show you that but I can show you exactly how to toggle that feature on and off so if you click the start button and go to settings and then up here in the find a setting box just type full the word full f-u-l-l -L, and you'll see there's an option that says use start full screen now if I were on a PC with an activated version of Windows, and I will do that soon, I promise Microsoft. Please don't come after me. Um, normally all of these buttons would be lit up and you'd be able to interact with them. And you can see right here there is an option that says use start full screen. And if that's ticked on, make sure that you put it into the off position and your start button will be normal and happy again, just like this. That's it. My name's Chris. Thanks for stopping by hope I was able to help you out today. Um, if you are running into a computer problem or something frustrating on your computer, please leave a message down in the comments and if I'm able to, if I'm able to help out, I would love to make a video showing you how to overcome any computer woe that you're having. Uh, remember to hit the like button and subscribe. Uh, that helps me out on my road to YouTube partner. Uh, it's not not looking to become a YouTuber full-time, but I do like helping people out. And hey, if I could make a little bit of money while I'm doing it, I'd love to do that. All right, guys. Thanks very much. And check out some of my other videos. Thanks. Bye.